mane de terra y de se una época y sin un muro de estupic entre yo me la hice te oyó sabe yo que te escabes sabe yo no me like cuando yo me he vuelto a ver a mol fue el pico por cinco años y me he vuelto this fall and some of you don't like where you are right now but you got to enjoy the process you got to enjoy the grind but my cerebral palsy people say I am grow say I am what God created me to be say I am grow I am what God created me to be I am grow I am what God created me to be Nobody can stop my disability. Nobody can stop my dream. Only me. Nobody can stop my dream. Only me. Today I would like to say, sometimes you go get tired of being where you are. But you get to understand. You have the time in your life where people need you. People need your, your message. People need the word of encouragement in your life. I was born in 1993 with Sheriff Pond. My mother had me at five months. My family had no idea I was going to be doing what I'm doing today. I wanted to be so many things in my life. I wanted to be a police officer. I wanted to be a doctor. I wanted to be a football coach. But those things never worked out. Never worked out for me in my life. But what did work out for me? Me motivation. Me motivation to be king. You can do today. You may not like where you are at right now. But God get ready to move you. You just gotta believe in faith. You got to trust in faith that God about to get ready to move. Whatever your dream is, I don't know. I don't know what to be called to. But what I do know about you, you're amazing. God don't make no junk. God make a gift. God make a gift. You were created in the image of God. You, when God, when God, before you was in your mother's womb, God had a plan for you the day you were born. I don't know what your plan for you is. But my plan, what God get for me is motivation speaking. And I want to say to you, who are you? Are you what the world say you are? Or are you what God say you are? Because God can move up mountains. Sometimes you could get frustrated. Sometimes, sometimes you can get frustrated in your life. But you got to understand why I'm here for a purpose. It's the reason why you wake up every morning. It's the reason why you go to a job and you only get paid twenty dollars an hour. Be thankful. Be grateful. Because everything I do right now is by the grace of God. My name is Dizzle Henderson. I've been a motivated speaker for five years. And not once I have no complaint about my circumstances. Not one time. I just do what I do to do what, do what I've been gifted to do in this life. So I want to say to you, Sometimes you gotta get discouraged. Sometimes you gotta. Sometimes 
you will not have the money. But you got to keep going. No matter if you don't get the job you want, you got to be grateful where you are at. You got to let God move you to a certain place in your life. I want you to understand. Think about the people that you want to help. Maybe you, maybe you aren't thinking about the people that you want to help, and maybe you don't get the resources. But the resources are out there. Understand this. There are only three things that you can know. Number one, God is for you. Number two, God is not against you. Number three, God created you for a purpose. And what's your purpose? I don't know. But I do know one thing about you. You were gifted with a gift. You've been called to do something what nobody else can do. My mentor, Les Brown, when I talked to Les Brown on the phone, he said, you inspire me, Denzel. Cause you know why I inspire Les Brown? Because I should be complaining about my life. I should be complaining. But I'm not. I'm not complaining. Let Brown love to see me do what I love. Let Brown want me to fulfill my death. He don't see me complaining. He see me enjoy life, enjoy what I love to do. No matter you don't get the money, no matter you don't get website, no matter you don't get business, and you don't get business card, you can make it by the grace of God. I am David Henderson, and I'm the Sheriff of Paul's Grinder.